SOLIDWORKS 2021 has a huge set of new features and performance enhancements. Let's take a closer look at some of them right now. SOLIDWORKS CAM has been around for a few years now. We have some great enhancements in CAM 2021. Default stock bounding boxes can now be saved inside of your TechDB. So I don't have to constantly rechange them. I can just save them as a name and reuse them over and over again. And it's very simple. I set up the bounding box information for the stock. So in this case, it's six by six inches by three eighths. I can give it a stock ID. I can even save the actual material information itself in there. And it's all saved in the TechDB so I can reuse it over and over again. Generating a tool pass takes just a few seconds and I can see a general strategy, the first uh, cut here for machining my part. But if I wanna take a little closer look at the drills here, you now can see that in SOLIDWORKS CAM 2021, we can specify our pecking based on diameter and by flute as well. We'll change those that information there. And again, not only changing it for this particular machining operation, but I can say that in the tag DB, and that means my modifications here can become the next defaults. Well, what if I have six by eight stock? Well, I mean, I can just change that and I'll even save it in the tech DB there so I can reuse that as well. But now in CAM 2021, when we make a change to stock, we will get a prompt here just to kind of run us through all the things that will be affected and recalculated based on the new stock. So I know exactly what's changing after the stock is modified. Let's take a look at some more stock information here and try some round stock, which is now new in CAM 2021. So if I have eight inch diameter, uh, quarter inch thick plate, and I wanna make that round stock uh, specified in here and see how my machining strategy is going to change, I can do that here. So round stock is also now new in 2021. And lastly, as people make post processors, instead of copying it to your C drive on every machine, we can now specify a network file location, which will allow everyone to use the same post processors. So that's just some of what's new in SOLIDWORKS 2021. To find out more, go to www.gsc-3d.com today.